Oh my bitches, hi guys, welcome to a brand new video. Today I'll be reacting to Love Victor, season one, episode nine. We are only two episodes till the end of the season. And I'm sad, there's two episodes, this one and then one more, then that's it. So anyways, I'm not, I'm, I'm a bit sad about that because I really love this show and I'm so, and that's why I think I've kind of been prolonging watching it because like I don't want to binge it because I don't want it to be over because I've just, I've saved every episode and it's just been so, so lovely and I, it's just been so nice. So, ugh. Anyways, um, Victor went to New York to see Simon and Bram and oh my god, it was the sweetest thing because I think uh, Victor really needed that because he could, I think he finally started to accept himself and was like, it's, it's okay. And it just made me so fucking happy and I'm just like, oh my, he's going to come back and maybe he'll like have the confidence to come out to his, pe his family, his friends. I don't know, but like... I'm hoping, fingers crossed. And then we also had uh, Lake and Felix. Uh, Lake started to finally, you know, baby steps to Felix. And I kind of, you know, with that hierarchy thing. Andrew's kind of a good guy. He is a good guy. He's starting to show it a little bit. So things are happening. And the dad has a secret. So anyways, let's just get right into episode 9. Let's go. Oh, the photos are so cute. Are you awake? Over. I, I don't know. What's up, man? I, I could have come to yours. Oh. Is he no. gonna tell him now? I'm not ready. My mom's a really good sleeper. So what's up? I don't know how I'm gonna say this, but <gasps> he's doing it now. I know that if I don't say now, I'm gonna lose my nerve, so um... Oh no. Yes, do it, do it, do it. Here it goes. I'm sorry, it's just too much pressure with you staring at me, especially since you hardly ever blink. What? are you talking about? I blink a normal amount. <laughs> Sorry. I... like guys. Oh! <laughs> he did it! He did it! Like, I'm into them. I really wanted to make things work with Mia because... she's awesome. Mm -hmm. But I... but I can't. I just want to say really quickly, I'm so proud of him. That was the first time he kind of said, you know, I like guys. Like he, he's, oh my god, it was his first time saying it. Oh, I feel this will be fine with it. If he's not, like, I'll hurt him. He'll be fine. But like, <laughs> it's so cute. I'm so proud of him. We're really getting into the feelings in this episode. We're really getting into the feels. I'm not okay. I'm just so proud of him. Okay. Oh, yes. Yes. I'm not gonna cry, I promise. But I'm really happy you told me. Me too, me too. And this me doesn't too. change anything between us, obviously. This is why Felix has Actually, rights. Is. So cry. Stop crying, you <laughs> made me aware of my blinking. You were taking my eye. <laughs> <sighs> you were the easy one. Yeah, no. Yeah. Okay. Telling me is gonna suck. It'll be fine. You should understand. Like you cheated on her or kissed kiss Benji. Oh Whoa. I know. Yes. See, this that's the issue now is gonna be that he kissed Benji, not that he's gay. So that's gonna be interesting. But uh but she can't I see because we know that he had to find out. I, it's just, it's, it's, oh, it's gonna get messy. But I hope it's gonna be fine. I hope it'll be fine. Fingers crossed. Hey, is this a new jacket? Mm -hmm. Yeah, suits you. Macho. No, I just mean like, uh, what's their deal? Are they uh, guys, girls? How old are they? Well, let's see. There's Kyle, the ninth grader, and there's Fabian, the male underwear model who insists on playing without a shirt. <laughs> Is that too soon? I don't know, but that's funny. Sorry, I was... Sorry. Good luck and have a great first day of lessons. Okay. Okay. I get his reservation, though. Like, I can understand why he's a bit hesitant still. Like, I can understand that, but... We're kind of like if Taylor Swift was dating the dog from a dog's purpose. Hey, you're not a dog. Yes. You're charming. You have thick, shiny hair and really nice brown eyes. Yes. You are literally describing the dog from a dog's purpose. <laughs> Am I doing it? Am I walking towards her? <laughs> nope. You are fully rooted in place. I said it before and I'll say it again. She's way too good for you. 
<laughs> okay, 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 okay. Hey, before you say anything, I, I know I've been MIA. So, are you in? We'll either have an amazing dinner or we'll get mercury poisoning. <laughs> I'm, I'm nervous. I'm nervous. Oh, for me. I'm nervous. It's, uh, it's Japanese for I'll see you later. Yes, boy. Yes. Mm. Like, like, I've been thinking. I should be more honest with you about what I want. Look, I think we should go to the dance together. <laughs> me too. Uh, not really into dances. What? That's a lie. We love everything dance related. It's not ready to put us under the creek with microscope. So we can only see each other in a supply closet? I can't live in the shadows lake. I'm pale enough as it is. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Well, uh, my parents won't be home after school. Maybe it'll be so hot you'll catch a tan. Oh, wow. Like, oh that God. was smooth. Um, and just to be clear, we're not advancing bases. We're just advancing to an actual bedroom. Totally as if someone want to play in my sock situation accordingly. Shh. He's so adorable. Stop. Oh, no. The moment I've waited for. Hey. Didn't think you were working today. I'm not clearing out my stuff. Wait, what? Excuse me. Starting next week, I'm transferring to a different location. Oh, the disrespect. Is it because I kissed you. My relationship with Derek isn't perfect. Yeah, I know. But I don't want to lose him. And when you kissed me, it put me in a tough spot. Cause you had feelings for him. No, the idea of working with you every day <laughs> makes me feel guilty. Why? You didn't do anything wrong. Yeah. I know that. It's because he felt something. It's because you felt something when he kissed you. And you knew in your heart that he... Okay. Did he, so I missed, did he say that he told Derek and Derek was angry or whatever? I don't care. <laughs> I don't want to lose Derek. I understand that he's been in a relationship with Derek for like a year. So like, you know, there's history. I get it. But you can't ignore the fact that you're transferring. Look, I get it. Like... I get, I can, I can, I get, it's awkward, I, I understand. But we know the real reason is because he has feelings for Victor and doesn't want to admit it. That's what I'm assuming is happening. Well, I could be wrong, but I think that's why. That's, well, that is majority the reason why he's well, leaving. I, guess, uh, I think it's best if we stay out of each other's way. I'm offended by this episode. Get out of my face. Literally get out of my face. Benji won't even talk to me. Why does everything have to be so hard? Benji's going through his own problems. Don't worry, it's fine. He'll come around. Oh my God, is that you as a little girl? Oh, crap. Oh uh, my no. Mom's hard. Just get under the bed, okay? Go, go. As far as boy bags go, that is a very ugly backpack. Shut uh, up, Mrs. Merriweather. Well, my stylist failed because her ch this jacket just makes your shoulders look like you're a bouncer. Please, I really want you to go through some of these looks. Is the mum okay? Uh, okay. <laughs> Yay, fun! Nah, I don't know if I'm a fan of the mum, to be honest. You just gotta rip the gay band-aid off and hope that eventually she forgives you. <laughs> yeah, I know. He doesn't know. He, he's right. When I screwed things up with all my friends, they wouldn't talk to me either. Yeah, I so, know. I wrote them a big apology on Creek Secrets. Maybe try and help Benji understand where you're coming from. Mm. I feel this at the same time. B! He calls him B! Get out of my face! B, get, get fucked. Go away! I missed Benji so much, but like, he's being very like weird about this whole situation, which I can understand, but like, he has to understand why Victor did it. It was... He has to understand! That's obviously the point of the letter. Who's that? You told that stupid joke to make me think that your students were all children. That you weren't giving lessons to grown ass men in our apartment. Armando! Is that of you someone's about something the like student's that. dad or something? That's exactly what somebody who betrayed her husband and her family would <gasps> No, no. It's the daughter of... The man you saw wasn't a student. He was dropping off. A student. Wow, Armando, so please. How long until I can play all of that sounds amazing. Damn. See, now we know what he, how he really feels. He's still not over it, which I understand he's still weary of it, but should have believed her this time. Oh, honey, this one's a keeper. 
I can do my own shopping. Oh, you just work so hard to lose all that weight, and I just want you to present yourself for the most flattering. Life she possible. looks fine. I think I'm presenting just fine. Exactly. Do you think I'd be the top-rated anchor in Greater Atlanta if I presented just fine? Oh, get out of here, you idiot! Oh, not. No, you bet your ass I wouldn't. Now look. You do fine in school, but clearly your grades aren't going to open any doors. So you need to get used to putting. Oh my foot god! Forward. And that means knowing how to look curvy but not big, and attractive but not like a floozy. Excuse me. Public perception is crucial. You are the worst news woman I have ever seen on my screen right now. What's her name? I actually don't want to even know her name because she does not deserve for me to know her name. What a bitch! Like she's so materialistic. Like all these un unrealistic expectations for her daughter. No wonder, like you know. But Lake's trying to be, like, you know, better, like she is. But, like, her mom's saying all this stuff to her. Like, how would you feel, like, you know, your child, you know, your mother, like, saying all this to you? Like, you take it in, you take it personally, you take it in, and it affects you. It affects your mental health, of course. And, like, the mom, you know, oh, you have to, do you have to wear this? You have to, you have to look like this? Like, no. And the thing Felix is having is had enough. He's going to probably go off. Can you go off at the mom? I'd love that. She is insane. Your body is literally perfect. Felix, Thank you. I just... Sneak you out the back door. I can't even look at you knowing you heard that conversation. Oh. Actually, I want to take you somewhere. Show you something. Oh, I love them. I love them! Before they get cold. <laughs> you got hey, it. Look, I, I wanted to talk. Mia, we're home. Oh! Really? Um, wow, I guess you're finally here. Hello. What the hell? Are big fans of Instagram. <gasps> pregnant! You can't tell him we is she, his Instagram. Is she pregnant? Is she? That's why she was like feeling sick, you know, not morning sickness, but like she was feeling, you know, ill, you know, and like obviously fish would like is is not good not good for them it, the smell of the sushi isn't good you know she doesn't like that smell and she's holding her stomach is that too obvious that she's pregnant is it obvious i don't know but holy shit oh my god are you pregnant <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Me. Yes, I'm, I'm 10 weeks pregnant she didn't see that coming okay i think it became the right time when she figured it out mia we're getting married Oh, We're gonna tell you. What a bombshell. The right moment. What a bombshell. Um, I'm sorry, I just, I, I need a minute. Honey. See, this ruined Victor's coming out to her, though. Like, oh, well, damn it. Congratulations. <laughs> sorry. Far out, it ruined everything. Why does it have to be so hard? Holy shit. My mom and I have lived here since I was born. Holy shit. Matt, my mom was buying me all that stuff to distract me from what was really going on. And what was really going on? She always suffered from depression. Oh shit. And she developed this inability to part ways with stuff. I did not <sighs> expect hey, this. Like, uh, I saw your life. I wanted you to see mine. Mm -hmm. Look, this might be where I live, but this is not a reflection of who I am. Damn, true? The way your mom sees you is not a reflection of you. Oh! You are already the best version of yourself. No, oh, honey! Why is Felix You're smart? You're funny. You're beautiful. Mm hmm. Oh, For yeah. The record, I know what beauty looks like. There's about a thousand Cosmo magazines in that corner to prove it. He's the sweetest. I'm actually like... <laughs> Say that? Oh my god! Felix just has my heart! I know he was frothing with Benji or whatever, but like, Felix... If I really had to choose, I'd choose Felix. Like, that's the t I would choose Felix. If I had the option, I'd choose Felix. He's just... He has my fucking heart! He stole it! He... 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 Stole my heart, Felix, man. I don't know when it happened, but it happened. He stole my heart. I love him. 
Oh, like, he's so lucky, man. And he is lucky, too. But, like, and she, 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 he's right what he said to her. She's beautiful. She doesn't need, she's not a reflection of what her mum thinks. Oh, my God. Straight for, oh, my God, I'm dead. That was such a nice scene. That was such a nice scene. Now he's going to have a new wife. And a new baby. No, but it's not going to mean he's not going to care about you. You're still part of the family. He's moving on. He's not moving on. You're still going to be his whole world. Mm -hmm. Yes. That man is crazy about you. And that's never going to change. No yeah. matter how many he's right. wives or children he has. He's not your mom, man. Yeah. Mm. That's true. That's true. That's very true. Okay, now you're gonna tell me I'm sorry, but you can't keep going like this. What would I do without you? <laughs> Don't feel bad. Do it. Rip the bandaid off. Go ahead. He has oh, to. Um, he has to. Oh. Thank you. Come to the dance with me. Yes, please. Like, who cares about public perception? We're great together. This fact. I can't. Come on. I care too much. About what other people think. Yeah, that's a flaw that she has. I understand. Thank you. At least she was honest about it. But whatever this is like, I can't do it anymore. Nah, I understand that. I'm sorry, this is over. That's fair. I'm sorry, he had his... That's fair. That's fair. That breaks my heart, but it's fair. Because he can't keep going like this. And if she cares what other people think, she'll come around in the next episode. I'm hoping she better come around. Because she knows. she has a gold mine. It just breaks my heart, actually, when you think about it. It really just breaks my heart. But you know what? He did the very mature thing. Like, yeah, it was a bit of fun in the meantime. But at the end of the day, she still doesn't want to be seen with him in public or, like, you know. And at least she can admit that she cares about other people. She can admit that. At least she can admit that. But he had to be like, he can't... As much as it breaks his heart, he can't do it anymore. And I, I respect that. So I'm hoping something changes next week. I mean, in the next episode. But uh, I, I understand. I'm gonna go take Adrian out for ice cream. Let you guys hash out the source of this awkward ass dinner. Come on, put on your shoes. I'm not gonna give up doing what I love. I messed up. But I am tired of being this family's punching bag. If you hadn't have beaten the crap out of Roger after what happened, you wouldn't have been fired and we would have never had to move here. Oh, shit. Hey, Victor. We didn't want to overwhelm you guys with all the details. Right. But you're cool with overwhelming us with your constant fighting. <laughs> you don't think wrong? we can all tell how off you guys are? You... Adrian can sense it too. He's little. He's not dumb. Damn. It's... Look, I get that you guys are going through something. And I'm sorry. But you make this house feel like a shitty place to come home to. Ooh. You need to do better. Oh my god. Not fair. Hmm. I'm sorry for swearing, but, um... I... I'm actually shocked. Fair enough. Fair enough. I mean, is he wrong? Like, I understand that you shouldn't have to wear... I understand I have the... You know. But... I understand why he went off like that. Like, I... Damn! I'm proud of Victor. I'm so proud of him today. Hey, Vic. Come and take ten bucks out of your wallet. Say nothing at all. Oh, she's gonna see something, yeah? About him being gay, or she's gonna see something. Oh, no! Oh, no, to Benji! To Benji! B, first of all, so sorry for kissing you. Oh my god. Please, just hear me out. Who the hell is B? Oh, shit. Damn, no! Oh my god, he's so lucky he didn't write Benji on that on that paper. But now it's all gonna culminate. Now everything's gonna culminate in the finale because like Pilar's in this letter and she's like, who's B? Because like he knows. Uh, but she's gonna say something. She will, will she say something to Mia? Because we don't know who she doesn't know who B is. But like she'll tell Mia, oh he cheated on you or something, and then that'll explode. Oh, for fuck's sake, no, I can sense that shit. No. I'm stressed, man. Why? Why? No. Why did that have to happen? Damn it. They have to escalate the drama somehow, right? 
Damn it, this is not okay. She's gonna have to tell she's gonna tell me, alright? The, the the proper thing to do would be to talk to Victor first to find out what the fuck was going on. And then depend you know. Cause now now it's all gonna explode in his face and it's it's gonna come out and things are gonna happen. The parents are gonna everyone's gonna find out once it's spent well that oh my god, she cause me is gonna con Okay, my my prediction for the finale is that Pilar's gonna I would like her to talk to Victor first. I would like that. But I feel like she might go to Mia and then Mia will confront him and it'll like explode and something's gonna it's gonna un oh my god Anyways, um, that was very rude to end it like that, because now I need to watch the next episode, like, straight away, because I'm not going to be, you know. So, that was my reaction, but, okay, so, uh, hold on, let's just talk about the episode first, before I, um, I got distracted. Um, even though there wasn't much victory in this episode, like, there was, but I feel, I, I've been, I've grown so attached to, like, all the other characters, right? So, like, having Mia's dad and Veronica, like, you know, getting engaged and now, you know, getting married and, like, having a baby, like, this has got like, thrown me, so Victor couldn't tell it, tell her, and then we had Lakin, and, and Lakin, Felix, and uh, Felix finally did the adult thing, and was like, you know what, I can't do this anymore, yeah, it was fun at first, but now, this is, a, this is ridiculous now, what, what, what's happening, I, I can't do this anymore, 100, 100% respect that, okay, thank you, I love that, Fe uh, uh, Victor coming out to Felix, it's so cute, I love that, and Felix, and you know what, Felix has my heart, Felix stole my heart, okay, I don't know when it happened, but it happened, he took it, um, Benji leaving, oh, whatever, good luck, um, oh, no, I'm sad, no, but we need to resolve it, I'm, I feel unresolved with this storyline, with, um, Benji and, and Victor, I need team, I need them to talk to each other, and can Derek break, can they break up Derek and Benji, please, I don't, I'm over it, um, anyway, sorry, Oh, so much happened, and then we had the drama of the dad and the mum, but so the dad, like, full bashed up, what's his name? So many, oh my god, things are happening, okay, that was a lot, that was a lot, but like, <sighs> I love how when Victor's are kind of finally comfortable to come out, like, all these things have to happen, and it's gonna culminate in the finale, and I'm not okay, anyways, that was my reaction video, what did you guys think, let me know in the comments, and I'll see you guys for the finale soon, love you guys, and ciao for now, bye guys!